Listen. Oh yeah, fan works, fan works. All right, folks, here's the deal. This is, oh, bright, real bright, that's what it is. This is a Dell Vostro 3700, uh, let's see, the, this thing. Uh, this is a Dell Vostro 3700 board. This fan, I have replaced it and it still does the same thing. It will do this for a minute and then just stops. And I've determined that it is not sending proper power to the board. Here we go, plug it into the ground here and plug it into the five volt here and look what we got. Look, see that? See that? When I'm not shaking it the wrong way, the fan works fine. Look, you can't see it, but I bet you can hear it. Listen. Oh yeah, fan works, fan works. Fan works fine. Doesn't work in the actual machine. Fan works fine. So here's what we're gonna do. I have the iron heating up, and let me show you. I've already scraped one, but I have to do the others. Um, what I'm gonna do so that this computer will be functional at all, because with no cooling it just crashes. Good heat sink grease still crashes. Look down here at this, okay? See this thing right here? This is the SATA connector for the hard drive or in this case it's a solid state drive but this is a SATA connector what we're gonna do is if you look down at the board see how quick I, how far I can zoom before it freaks out I've already scraped one these this is the power connector and the pinout is you've got 3.3 volt ground 5 volt and 12 volt at least I think that's how it goes um, or maybe it's three point, maybe it's three point three and ground and five and yeah, I can't remember. But the point is, I know that that middle one is five. So I need, I just need to scrape another trace, and we're gonna rewire this fan using these uh, Ethernet cable wires here that happen to just fit nicely in there. We're gonna rewire the fan to just be straight over here, uh, powered by that thing. And that's the end of it. It will power it straight off the hard drive connector. Now, the problem that I'm running into is that the fan will run full blast. So I'm gonna get it hooked up, and if the fan runs full blast and it's too loud and it's a problem, I'll probably throw a small resistor on there. I need to look at the fan itself to get the values for that. Um, but, but something reasonably small to limit the speed of the fan and that way it'll work. But this connector is just not delivering the power needed to make the fan work for whatever reason. So we have to cool it ourselves. Um, the computer, the computer works perfectly fine as long as it has power. If the computer does not have power, um, or rather, if, if it, uh, the computer works fine if it's cooled, if it does not get cooling, then it crashes. So we're gonna make the fan just statically run. Eh, whatever.